Hello and welcome to Dochio, a short little RPG Maker game developed by Hima Wariness,、uh, available on Itch.io. You know, I played a game from this、uh, same developer before. It was called Hansel, and it was pretty interesting. I gotta, I, I gotta say though, the, the most striking thing I remember though was the ending.、It、was very surprising compared to the rest of the game, it seemed, but well, I don't know. Anyway, but this one,、um, again, made by the same person,、uh, seems to be more wholesome, actually. It just seems to be just a, a wintry adventure of a automation, I guess. I guess we'll see what it's about. Just, it just seems like a little, cute little game. But well, let's see. It's like a Christmas theme as well because I believe it came out on Christmas and everything. I don't know when I, when I release this on YouTube. Are we obviously Christmas will、so、be way over, I imagine. But、uh, right now though, it's just still pretty close、uh, to Christmas. Depending on what you consider the holidays to be, you know, if if you count it like the week after, and also New Year's. Anyway, hurry, hurry! The mail carriers are here. Where did I put my letter? The hair, the hair. Another year, I can hear all of the cheer from here. Another year will go by again. Maybe I can go if I ask Grandma one more time. All right, and we're a little、uh, again automation. It's kind of like a toy soldier, kind of like oh、well, yeah, the, the Nutcracker. You know what we call it. Get the game. Hmm. The interact stuff. Hmm. Oh, I wonder what it's like to go outside. Just like a talking toy. Grandma puts food in here. It doesn't look very full. She doesn't eat a lot.、It's、snowing outside. I'm not allowed to leave. Guess not. Let's go over here. Grandma calls this the toilet. I'm not sure why she comes in this room a few times every day. I don't know what I don't know what pee pee and poo poo is. I don't understand. I don't have bowels. Hmm. It's a lump of coal. Well, is that bad? Some pictures of grandma and people I don't know. Grandma says that she'll tell me the story behind them someday. It's full of my clothes. Grandma sews them herself. Stepping on ink, paper. Do we just like? I mean, I assume because that's our clothes. Do we just? Is this our room? We just sit here the entire time, you know? Don't need to eat. Don't need to sleep. Basically, immortal. Grandma. Dochio, what's wrong? The mail carriers are here. Can't I? Don't you? You know the answer. You're fragile. I don't want anything to happen to you. But the town is right down the hill. I can take your letter too. What are you talking about? I can take both our letters. Please, before they leave, just once. I'm sorry. Okay, maybe next winter then. No, absolutely not. You'll be in this house forever. You see, you're nothing but a toy, no, Dochio. I'll go make us some hot chocolate, even though you can't drink it. <laughs> you know, I assume anyway. Isn't that cruel? <laughs> Just here, have some hot chocolate that you never get to drink. Uh, she was writing a letter for sure. Why won't she take it to the mail carrier? Yeah, can't she be? Why won't she take it to the mail carriers? A bag of coal. Grandma doesn't let me touch it.、Hmm. You know, isn't like you know, any bad boys and girls get coal for Christmas or whatever. But I mean, coal. I assume in this like fantasy world, it kind of takes place in. You know, it's always weird. Any kind of like fantasy RPG kind of takes place in medieval fantasy, but it's always often like modern conveniences as well on top of that. 
So I'm never really sure what era it takes place in, but you know, maybe coal isn't so bad if it's your fuel source, right? To keep warm in the winter. I don't know. This is where Grandma put her letter. Locked. I've got to get the key from her somehow. But first, you gotta sneak up behind her. And knock her unconscious. A lot of toy making tools. Hmm. Yes, she makes a lot of toys. Or is that hot chocolate, Grandma? Hot chocolate always makes me sleepy. If only you could try some. Maybe I'll go back to sleep. The mail carriers always pass by so early. Hmm. You should get some sleep too. You are up all night waiting for them. Yes. Okay, we do sleep, by the way. I'm sorry, Dojio. It's okay. I know you mean well. This is my chance. Time to... Destroy her. No, I'm... Actually, can I try this again? I'll put food in here. Just okay, same. Same dialogue. Uh, I guess she's over here, I think, right? No, that's the washroom. Never mind. That's the wrong place. Over here? Oh, that's just my room. Where is it again? Oh, yeah, over here, I imagine, yeah. This is where the bed was. I've gotta hurry before the mail carriers leave. She's asleep. Now's my chance. I... I... I don't know. I use suplex her. No, um... Grandma's apron. It should be around here somewhere. Found it. With this key, I should be able to open up Grandma's workshop drawer. And take all her things. Oh, same dialogue. It's kind of weird to repeat that dialogue. This is where Grandma put her letter. With the key, I should be able to open it. There, it's open. And here's Grandma's letter. Hopefully, the mail carriers are still in town. And nothing will go wrong. That's well, Dick next. You know, we'll just simply send a letter, go back home, and that'll be it. That's the end of the game. It was just a little story about. A weird toy soldier exploring the outside for a little bit and going back home and nothing you know, nothing bad happens. Here goes. My first time outside. Just this once. No, I can't be scared. All I have to do is give the letters and come back. I'm outside. I'm outside. It's so nice. And it's snowing. Well, actually, I mean, it's funny how people like people who never see snow are always amazed by snow. But people who always see, see snow, like me, who live in you know, I live in Canada, which you know it, it isn't like a tundra, you know, all the time where I live anyway. Because most people who live in Canada or live near the south border or whatever, so it's actually quite temperate. But you know, you just get four seasons. It's annoying though because when it snows, uh, it's just I don't know. It's like, like a lot of annoyances that come up with snow, right? Like you know, like wear boots and everything. You know, when you have like a a climate of four seasons, you know, you gotta prepare for it for every season, right? That's annoying. Anyway, Grandma's gonna be so mad. I'll just be quick. I'll take these to the mail carriers and be back before she wakes up. Gotta wear snow boots, you gotta get your coat and everything. I mean, it's not like the worst thing in the world. Again, it's just slightly annoying. And it's not, you know, all that amazing. Like, because you grew up with all the seasons and everything. And obviously it's cold, you know? Does, does Dojo feel cold, by the way? That's probably part of it as well. He feels no cold. Temperature is not a thing to him. There's a town, I can see it. I'm almost there, I can do it. Right there, it's drawn in the distance. With like low level of detail, the save on resources. Well, not really, because it's a drawing, but you know, I just know like a lot of video games where something's like really far away. It like, it looks really uh, low detail to save on, you know, again, resources. It reads to Eve. I finally get to see what it's like. This town called Eve. I'm just making sure I'm interact with anything else. No, okay. In and out. Just gotta find the mail carriers, give them the letters, and go back home. Easy. Easy job. Well, this is what the, what a town is like. 
It's a lot bigger than I thought. How old is Docho? I assume Docho was made. I, I like he's not a human, so he's like he was just made like this. I just wonder how old he is. Like a baby, probably. I hope I don't get lost. I don't know how I don't know how it works in this universe. Also, it's kind of weird like, when you save. I, I guess the first save file it kind of looked like he was headless. By the way, I didn't know it was a horror game. But no, it's just his, his sprite is just very tall, kind of like cuts off. A lot of bells. I knew I never seen so many bells in one place before. What what type of bells are these? Hello? This is no one here. No one here to sell bells. More coal. It's a bag of coal. The king sent that to us. Isn't he wonderful? The king? Wow. He can grant wishes and give coal. Yeah, I said before, yeah, coal is not a bad thing because it keeps the place warm in this world, I guess. Wow, an automation. Or auto, automa, uh, uh, automaton? Hmm. I thought it was automaton. Oh. I just reminds me of Near Automata now. Near Automata, Automato, aut Automata, 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 Automata. Wow, an automaton. It's been a long time since I've seen one. What brings such a cute automaton to Eve? I'm trying to get some letters to the mail carriers. Well, you aren't going to find them here. If you hurry, you might be able to catch them outside. Okay, thank you. For some reason, music, by the way. A bit of the melody reminds me of Maple Story for some reason. A little bit. Like Hennessy's, you know, when the first area is Maple Story. At least if you start, I believe you start as an archer. Anyway. Whoa, an automaton. Aren't you like a big toy? Maybe I should wish for one next year. I guess that's just a thing, by the way. No one's really scared of Docho, just a walking toy, a walking sentient toy. No one worries about that, it's just normal. Lots of treats I've never seen before. Grandma doesn't eat treats. Otherwise you get diabetes. A lot of bread and more. I wonder what they taste like. They do look yummy. Would you like to try one? Oh no, thank you. I can't eat or taste anything. I'm an inhuman monster. No, <laughs> but I'm sure these are wonderful. Oh, how unfortunate. Uh, wait, you're... are you an automaton? Of course, sorry. It's okay. Now, I wonder what rights <laughs> do these toys have? Do they have the same rights as humans, or...? Uh, the... Look at all that bread. I never knew there were so many different shapes of bread. Let's see. Do, 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 do. I don't know, it's music. again, the melody reminds me of Maple Story. The town keeps going. I hope I don't get lost. Hello. It's the mail carriers. It's actually them. What do I say? Excuse me, I have some letters to give you. Huh? You're the mail carriers, yes? I made it in time. Um, I think you're a little confused. We're not the mail carriers. They already left. Really? Oh no. They're headed to Alertabo. You might be able to catch them if you hurry. Alertable? 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 What's that? Alertable? As the, the, the town Alertable. How much you heard of it? Are you okay? Are you... Are you... Uh, a dummy? I don't know. Of course I have. I totally heard of it. Where is it again? Just go straight north from here and you'll reach it. Thank you. Um, you're going the wrong way. Oh yes, of course. I'll go this way. Thank you very much for helping me out. It's no problem at all. Good luck. Hope you reach them. Hmm. I mean, the little girl said, are we okay? Oh. Uh, what did you write in your letter? I asked for a teddy bear the size of my door. <laughs> the big teddy bear. It's a secret. Like, as if she doesn't know what an automaton is. But isn't it obvious? You know, people are surprised to see an automaton. I mean, there's a, literally a giant key behind them. I guess when you're facing him, you don't see it, but... I don't know. And then the, the, the man was like, how haven't you heard of it? But aren't, like, walking, talking toys? Uh, is it normal for them to know? I don't know, man. Because I, I assume 
Dolcio was kept in grandma's house his entire life, so he just doesn't know how the outside world works. Is that normal? I wonder. I don't know. Uh, were you here to get some letters too? Wolf. <laughs> just dogs. Huh? Sorry, I don't understand you. I don't speak dog. I don't understand your alien language. Hmm. Anyway. Ready to go? Well, let me save first. And then go. In case I miss anything. Not sure. I told myself I'd go right back. There's always next winter. But I'm so close. I could catch up. Woo woo. Let's go. Who are you? Heading out of town? Luckily it has stopped snowing. Well, it's not like the cold can bother an automaton like yourself. You're right. What does cold feel like? Hmm, I never thought of that. I'd say it feels refreshing, but sharp and prickly. Oh, wow. What do refreshing, sharp, and prickly feel like? Uh, this is gonna keep going, isn't it? Hmm? Okay. I ha have no such weaknesses of you weak human beings. You walking meatbags. I can simply walk in the snow without feeling anything at all. Uh, it says Lutable up north or Lutable to the east. Which way is it? The kind man, what did he say? Didn't he say it's north? Why is this sign so confusing? This way or that way? This way or that way? Hmm. Uh-oh, which way should I go? <laughs> I have to hurry. <laughs> what do I do? Uh. Hey. What's your problem? I don't know, I'm just giving this this guy a weird voice. I don't know, just from his face. Don't you realize you're standing on me? Who do you think you are? I don't know. Huh? I'm Dolcio. Don't hurt me. Are you gonna apologize or what? I'm sorry. Yeah, you better be sorry. Jeesh. Jeesh? Jeesh. I was sleeping so well. First of all, the noise from the town, and now, yeah. The town, Lurzabo, do you know how to get there? Why do you want to go there? It's full of troublesome people and kids. I have to deliver these letters fast. Let me see, let me see. Ooh, you're delivering letters. Please, can you tell me which way to go? On one condition. Condition? Listen here, buddy. These people are shouting about letters and wishes and whatever, and now, yeah. Now tell me, what's that all about? Grandma told me that the king can grant wishes, and he does so by reading letters delivered by him. But they can only be delivered by his special mail carriers that come around once a year. So I'm trying to catch up to them. This is my only chance. Hmm, I see, I see. Then, do you think I could, I could write a letter? I promise I'll help you out. Of course. You have a paper and something to write with? Oh, I don't have paper. It's okay. I'll rip a corner from my letter. It should be fine. Here. Thanks. I can write with this. Uh, I can write with this, rather. Okay. What is that on the tip? It's dirt, dummy. Okay, I thought it was poop. <laughs> but anyway. And now you just have to sign up your name so that he knows it's from you. I don't think my full name, uh, Ils Turisuris Girusmente Rutdrastral Hildeferut fits, I guess. I don't know. I don't know how to say that. Is, there, is that German? I don't know. Or is that just made up? Do you have a nickname? Oh, everyone just calls me, uh, Ils. Ils? Is it Ils? Ils? Everyone just calls me Ils. I'll put that down. Here you go. I'll put it in my envelope. So where is Lurtabo? Lurtabo is a tricky town. A lot of mischievous people. That's why the signs are all messed up like that. That's why you actually have to follow the sign that says Lurtabo to the east. So this way? Exactly. Be careful once you get there. Thanks, Eels. No problem. Now go, hurry. This is Lurtabo. 
It looks so festive and fun. I just have to find the mail carriers. Eternal search to find a uh, to find the the mail people. I guess a bag of coal from the king. She, my parents are asleep. The king sent us a gift. It's coal to help us keep warm. For some reason, though, the bag's pattern looks familiar. Mm, I don't know what that means. You can't really explore the entire house, I guess. You can only explore a little bit of the house. You Hi, do you know where the bell carriers are? Of course I know. They're inside the building with the red door. Oh, thank you so much. Hey, uh, actually, you've got something in your face. I do? Thanks for letting me know. Ha, <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha? What does that mean? Never mind. Okay. They do say that Lurtabau is a town of mischievous people. So maybe they're lying to us? Oh. The trash goes in here? Blah! No. Oh. How was that? That was a jump scare. I don't know. What are these? These are faces? Human face. Well, not human, but... They're like... They ripped up the faces of these creatures and put them on walls. This must be a hunter's place. Oh, there's babies in the music? Why is there babies in the music? Wanna buy a mask? A mask? Yeah, a mask. Like this. Like that. <laughs> this. You're an automaton. I can swap out your face. Choose the mask you like. My face? No, thank you. Wait, your face could sell for a lot. How about it? How about your face piece? What? I'll even throw in any mask you want for free. No! See yourself. If you're not gonna buy anything, I suggest you leave. Now, no window shopping, buddy. Ah, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't mean to loop into the same dialogue. It's just that in, in a lot of other RPG games, when you talk with someone multiple times, you get different dialogue, right? But Sometimes it just loops the dialogue. Oops. I'm out of money. I need some more to play again. Play the slots? Or is there a gambling town? Red door. This must be where that man said the mail carriers were. Hello? Go away. We don't want any more self-freezing water. Self-freezing water? How's this? Is it just... I mean, that's just ice, right? Or... Okay. You aren't the mail carriers. No! Okay. Um... I guess that's backwards. Uh, wanna learn how to speak like me? Huh? I can speak backwards. Have to find the mail carriers. Oh. I guess I'll go this way. Is someone else gonna jump off from here? Maybe. These bags are filled with trash, coal, and old toys. Another important present. Who are you? Doesn't that house look a little weird to you? Sometimes you can see it swaying the wind. A house that sways in the wind. Well, I mean, it looks like a fake house. I mean, it looks like a drawing, but I, uh, all, like, the entire world is a drawing, but I guess especially this one. Did you know the snow is made out of candy? You should taste it sometime. I hear it tastes better if you take it from the ground, especially if it's colored yellow. It's lime flavored, you see. <laughs> Thank you, that's nice to know. Okay. Everyone's just a liar. Everyone's just a jerk, I guess, in this town, but Dochio does not notice that. Well, that's a pretty statue. But it's been covered in ribbons. I wonder why. Such pranksters. Come on, come on, come win yourself a ticket to meet directly with King uh, Santalus yourself. Santalus? Santa? Maybe? The king! I can give him the letters! You there, automaton! As the only person I'm talking to. Me? Come closer, don't be afraid. Totally. I'm not gonna murder you. No. Oh? We're giving away big prizes right in there. Just play some games for a chance to win. Can I play? 
I'd like to speak to the king. Of course, you can head in with Xia whenever you like to play. Thank you. We're going to play some games. Well, there's nowhere else to go, it seems. I guess we're going to play some games. Hello, everyone. I'm glad you're all here to play. I have many wonderful prizes you can win, including a ticket to see the king. I can win the ticket to see the king. It'll be super easy. It's like playing the lottery. You just gotta be very lucky and then you win. So easy. All it takes is to correctly guess which cup has the ball. Oh. Just watch and choose. It's easy. It's totally not a scam. Oh. You there, kiddo. Why did you try it? A free round. Hmm. Okay. Now, which is it? The middle one. Correct! See? It's so easy a child can do it, and he's totally not in it. <laughs> With the the scam, where like, you you show like an easy win, and then later on you just squeeze him for all they have. What do you call that? I think it's called hustling. You like, gotta be careful when you're a tourist, you play those games. You just, you just want your money. Uh, who wants to go first? Me. The automaton, yes. Before we play, I'm gonna need some payment. After all, it's what helps me give out these wonderful prizes, yes. Payment? Don't you have anything? All I have are these letters. Um... How about that key in your back? Is that made of gold? I needed to move around. How about this? If you win, I'll give you the ticket and your key back. What a what a deal, right? What a deal. Sounds like a deal, huh? You get the ticket for free if you win. Come now, you're keeping the others waiting. Oh, sorry. Now we're ready to play. I have to watch carefully. All right, which one is it? It's under the. I don't know if it matters. Left cup. Oh no. Oh, that wasn't the correct cup. Wait, I need my key back. But you didn't win? You can try winning it back if you have anything else to give up. I don't. Who wants to play next? You can even win this golden key that I, that I got from this dumb kid. Get wrecked. But what am I gonna do? I have to play again. Totally not using sleight of hand to like do the magic trick where you like, show the ball, but then you just when you're moving the cups, you flick it into your wrist, and then you just keep it, and therefore <laughs> this is just a big scam. Uh, come again, Automaton, you're back. Want to play again? Yes. So what's your payment this time? How about my hat? Don't want it. Huh? Got anything else? My coat? Nope. My boots. No, my, the clothes off my backs. Uh, backs? Plural? No. The clothes off my back. Nuh uh. I have to get back to Grandma. All I have are these li. Hey! That stupid brat! Move, get out of the way! My key! Okay. Suddenly chaos. I guess the kid just stole that. I thought he was in on it, but... Wait a minute. There isn't a ball under any of these. See, I told you. This is like... Don't play those games, but I guess Dochi was just very naive. That kid. Always causing trouble. Have you seen a child running with a bag full of stuff? Have I? You tell me. I don't know. Yes? I guess you're right. I did see a kid run past here. Thanks. Free statue. I can't actually kind of look over here. Look at those fun games over there. I've never played any games like those before. Granny can't really play too much. Granny. I wonder how she's doing. Oh, okay. I'm just making sure I interact with everything. I guess that's it. I guess, uh, yeah, over there is just a carnival. I mean, this whole place is a carnival. I mean, I just like the I, I, car carnival games in general. Yeah, those are just scams, man. Yeah. Like, like, just like the cup and the ball. Like any any game you play, like a carnival, like uh, you know, like like a fair, you know. 
You know, like you throw the rings in the bottles, you throw the ball in, into the basket, you know, those are all scams. If you read about them, you, you learn that they're all like rigged, so you just never win. Did you see a kid run through here with a bag? What's in it for me? Uh, Mama told me I shouldn't tattletale on people. Stitches get stitches around here, see buddy? Uh, please help me. Okay, you don't have to yell at me. I may or may not have seen a suspicious person running towards the train station. Hmm. Okay, train station, any new view? Uh, there's a lot, there's a lot of commotion today. I like it. I like the chaos. I revel in it. Hmm. Boat. Uh, have you seen a child come through here? Uh, no. Um, I'm losing energy. Uh, check the mash shop. What are you saying? Are you new? I have to find a kid that has my key. Am I guess the mash shop. I'll talk to you. Uh, no, okay. I'll talk to the mash shop. Which uh, looks kind of familiar, actually. Is it, are you related to the other guy? It's very similar clothes. I don't know. A kid? Or have, I, have you seen like the kid run past here or whatever? A kid? Uh, not that I know of. Uh, well, that didn't sound too good. I need to hurry. Uh, talk to the guy in the red hat. He's one of my best customers. He's a know-it-all. He usually hangs outside by this store. Thank you. Okay. Do you know where a kid with a blue hat could have gone? Blue hat? Do you know how many kids with blue hats live in this town? No. Well, actually, there's only one I know of. I saw one over inside the house on the left. Or the, the house? I saw a typo, actually, but anyway. Okay. I guess, yeah, we're missing our key, so I guess we're just slowing down. It's just kind of like a wind-up toy, right? Without our key. We're gonna slowly die. You know, we're literally going to die. Did you see a kid run through here with a bag? What's in there for me? Again. Uh, uh same thing. Hmm. I thought I was supposed to go... Did I talk to the wrong person? Blue hat, blue hat. Where's blue hat? Oh, you maybe? No. Wait, I misread the dialogue. Let's say read again. I must have misread it. Blue hat, you know me, no. Inside on the house. Oh, inside on the la- I don't know why I thought, like, for some reason I thought to go the alleyway. I, don't, I got mixed up. Anyway. Talk to you! Oh, you have a red hat. You, you're not wearing a blue hat. Blue hat? Who told you I was wearing a blue hat? Oh, it must have been the guy outside the mask shop. He's colorblind. <laughs> oh, okay. That's why he said... That... Are you looking for someone with a blue hat? I've seen a kid with a blue hat around the path to the park. Don't tell my mom that I've been there. Okay. By the park. Running out of energy. Uh, uh. By the park? I mean, this is the park, right? That kid always trying to cause in trouble. Hmm. I'm gonna talk to you again? Blue. Blue. Hat. Blue hat? Kid. Blue hat kid. Blue hat kid. A kid with blue hat. Why did you say so earlier? I saw him sneak behind that present there. Thank... Okay. Please! Wow. Down here. I see some coal, by the way. Can I collect some coal? No? Can we burn the coal to give us some energy somehow? Can we eat the coal? Up these stairs. Almost out. Hmm. 
There's nothing cool in here, aside from the ticket. I found you. What? Oh, it's just a toy. What do you want? My key. This? Yes. Why'd you even give up this up if it's so important to you? You don't really think, do you? I... Don't... No... Dead. I can't believe Dolce was dead. Game over. We lose. Hey. Hey, Toy. Come on. Wake up. Uh. Uh-huh. I'm back. Wow. Did you save me? Who else could I? Thank you. Thank you, um... It's Noel. Or no, no, Noel, as I said. Noel. 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 I want to think of Noel now. I just think of Genshin Impact Noel, but... Noel? 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 I don't know how to pronounce words. I actually don't know how to pronounce Dolcio as well. I'm assuming it's Dolcio. But let me actually check real quick. How would you say it? Like, let's, uh, let's translate Noel. Noel. How do you say it? Noel. Noel. So now, I, I, I just, I checked it on Google. And it's related to Christmas. I guess that makes sense thematically. How do you pronounce Dolcio actually? Oh. Is defaults to Scottish somehow? Dolcio. Dolcio. Alright, I think that's pronounced correctly. Anyway, Noel and Dolcio. That's how you pronounce those words. Noel, thank you. Well, hey, don't ever let that happen again. You have to be tough. Don't let other people take advantage of you. But that's my defining character trait as the protagonist of this RPG game. What's your name anyways? Don't you? Don't you, huh? How'd you even fall for that trick? You're not from around here, are you? You're in Lertabo, the town of trouble. Trouble? Yeah, you've seen it. A lot of people here like to play tricks. You have to be careful. Then, even you? Um, that's right. Blah. <laughs> it's a jump scare. Oh no. So scary. Again, this is a horror game. Uh, if you don't leave this town now, you'll get tricked again. I can't leave. I have to give my letters to the mail carriers. The mail carriers? <laughs> they left a long time ago. Are you tricking me? No, I'm, I mean, yes? Uh, no is trying to fit in, I guess. Is being like a trickster, but it's not actually. Anyway. Is that why you're here in Lertabo? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they left super fast. There's not a lot of kids left here anymore. Really? Hmm. I've seen, like, at least... One... Two... Three. You know, including you. At least three. So... Uh, I guess relatively, maybe. They don't, there's not a lot of kids in the town. Uh, but never mind that. What better way to get your letter delivered than to give it to the king himself? Yeah. And here's the ticket. Hey! This is my ticket. I've got my own reason to see the king too. Then... You gotta find your own ticket. Okay. Well, where are you going by yourself? You get tricked again. I'm coming with you. Thank you. Why are you being so helpful and kind to me? Well, you see, I'm the second party member of this journey, and I'm, you know, I'm obligated to join on your adventure. No, uh, don't worry about it. Mm, it's full of stuff. Nothing amazing in there, though. Aside from what was your key and the train ticket. Hey, what does that say? A little scribble there? Uh, I think it says prize. You know, it just says prize. Uh, Noel, you know how to make toys? I guess you can say that. Hmm. I guess that's a very small room. It's a little shack, I guess. So you can go this way? Oh, okay. Cool. 
Uh, it's full of old materials and knickknacks. Got a problem with that? No, I think it's interesting. Oh, thanks. You know, I, I thought this was a trash can, you know, or, 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 or a dumpster or whatever. Which, by the way, I think I learned recently that dumpster... I believe- I could be wrong, I could be misremembering, but... Dumpster, I believe, is actually the name of a brand, you know? The, the, the actual... Dumpster itself is not really called a dumpster, I guess, but it be became that because of the company name that became so well known, you know, and connected to the actual object. Um, I guess kind of like, uh, let's see in the wind. Huh. Oh, okay. Oh, I was wondering. Oh, yeah, okay. It is this like weird, yeah, it's like a fake house that he made. Don't you follow in my decoy house? No one can tell my secret hideout is behind it. I thought it was a real house. It works. Huh? What does? Nothing. Okay. I was gonna say that yeah, the the dumpster is uh was actually the brand uh, that a long time ago that people just got used to saying you know kind of like Band Aid right Band Aid is also like a brand, but it's not really like called Band Aid you know the actual item I guess. Uh, so it's very candy, should taste it some time. Don't listen to her, Dolcio. It's no taste like water. Okay. None of it matters to Dolcio, though. He can't taste anything anyway. Uh, look at those fun games over there. I've never played any games like those before. Randy can't really play too much. Mm. Oh, I, already I, already I already read that, okay. I thought that did for dialogue, though. So jump over there, and okay. Uh, in every RPG Maker game, when a new party member goes with you, they have extra dialogue. That's the same. Uh, did it get off? Uh, sure, yeah. Thanks. Oh, okay, that's the... I think that's in the beginning where they said that uh, we have something on our face or whatever. Same dialogue. Okay, I, I was. I'm just curious. But uh, uh, no, he did say something. Uh, I I didn't see what he said, but I think he says you know you're not gonna get his face or whatever. Probably. I'm just looking for more dialogue. You know, extra dialogue. There you are, no Noel. How could you trick me? Go, Dojo. Distract him. You're good at that. Huh? Noel? Were you two working together? You won't distract me again. Uh, last call, boring for Candela, or Candalia. Oh, look at his, look at the conductor's face, he's so nonchalant. Noel! I'll break you apart and sell your pieces! I'm sure your gears will be worth a lot. <laughs> okay, I, I was wondering if automatons have any rights. I mean, this just this sounds like murder, basically, literally just murdering this sentient being and cutting him up and selling his organs. I don't know, man. Dolcio, let go of me, please. Man, he's just like bored. Look, look at that face. This is bored. Last call. Darn it. I get. Yeah. Hurry, here's the ticket. You'll miss the train. What about you? Hurry! Get off of me. I'll find a way there. You need to give those letters today. Go. Noel. Final boarding call for Candela. Candelia. Or how do you say that? Candelia? Candelia. I don't worry about fucking Dylan. I don't care about all this drama that's going on. I'm just, I'm just, let's just go. <laughs> yeah, now it's just you and me. Now I activate my special move. My super soap uh, suplex. Now go no, uh, go get him, my tiny mouse. Go for the eyes, boo. You. Ah. And then he gets murdered. He gets eaten by the mouse. And then... Uh, he just dies, you know? It's a very violent game. Um, this is my first time in the train. Aren't I supposed to be happy? Well, why? 
You were supposed to be here instead of me. I can't believe Noel's dead. I, he sacrificed his life for me. Though in my retelling of the story, or my telling of the story, Noel won, but anyway. Well, there you are. Well, here he is. He's just, he's just here. You were making it so difficult. If you took any longer at the station, my plan would have been ruined. Noel, how? I sneaked in. How else? I have a hundred in stealth. My, my sneaking skill is really high. They aren't going to check tickets again, probably. You, you're so nice, Noel. Hey, stop. No, I'm a trickster. That's what it says on my character sheet. <laughs> if you say so. Grandma, I'm going to deliver these letters. Ease? Please? Maybe? Tickets. Tickets, please. Ahem. Tickets, please. Yeah, be quiet. I'm trying to sleep. Do you have your tickets? Hmm? Oh, hello. Hello. Ticket, please. Noel, the plan. Huh? Docio, you idiot. You were supposed to act like a toy. Uh, squeak, squeak. <laughs> I'm a toy. I mean, he is a toy, though. But, like, it doesn't... I don't know. <laughs> well, I have my ticket here. Hey, let go! Don't you? You can stop acting. We're about to get kicked from the train. Oh, no. The try and pass one ticket for two people is unacceptable. Wait, wait, wait. Are you seriously about to throw some kids off a train? Yes. Murder is just, like, people have no rights here, you know? There's no child rights, no, like, sentient toy rights. Nobody has rights in this universe. Murder is just a common, common place. <laughs> yeah! And then we die. I can't believe we die. Stupid train. Are you okay? Your arm. It's bent the wrong way. If you were like a human being, that would be really fucked up, man. Like, he's just freaking... That was just attempted murder. But I guess you don't have rights, so it's okay. Ah. Phew. Okay, we just like... Do we, do we just like crack it the other way? Is that how it works? We don't really feel pain, you know? Pain is just not a thing. Ah. We should keep moving before it gets dark. I think that's Candelia over there. We should be fine if we follow the tracks. Hmm. Well, let's do that, I guess. I hope she's safe, by the way. Can we go the other way? No? Just go home. No, guess not. I guess we're just gonna have to walk. And this would be like 50 screens. Just like that one time I played Everhood. There's a game called Everhood that I played. There's that one secret ending where you gotta walk down the hallway, like literally for like hours and that's how you get the ending but anyway uh, wait don't you i'm tired let's take a break of course mm. Mm, this guy i knew it wasn't here things ills what is this thing i was on my way to see if you made it to the frost or made it to frost to me to frost i didn't think i'd find you in the middle of nowhere with a kid we got thrown off the train. I can see that. Tough. Come on, Delchion, let's keep moving. I'm feeling rested. You trying to get to that town over there before it gets dark? Foolish child. What you say? Watch your mouth. Everyone calm down. Look, luckily for you, this boy here is my good friend. I am? And a friend of his is a friend of mine. Look at my big beefy arms. I'll get you there in no time. Wow! Wee! Okay. Literally giant biceps. It's just gonna like take us to the town. Uh, I think I know a shortcut. Go for it then. Or then. 
Wee. Yeah. Super fast. It was going so fast. Too fast. Hi yai. On snow, I am unstoppable. And then we, we, we die again. This game's so violent. We always get injured. Uh, yeah. Who put that house there? What happened? Uh, that hurts. Wait. What is this place? A town? Did we make it to Candelia? Mm, no, this isn't Candelia at all. What town is this? Do you do? There's suddenly a ghost in front of us. We're in the horror town. We're in the spooky jump scare town where we get jump scared by many spooky ghosts. This house, doesn't it look like it's made out of coal? Hmm. Um, I think what he means by that is that maybe it's like burnt, maybe? It's like it's a burnt down town or something. Because Doshio, again, is very naive and doesn't know how the world works, I guess. Maybe, or I'm not sure, anyway. Hello. Hello, are you okay? A person? Are you an illusion? I'm neither. I'm Docio. And, you know, just vanish. Don't worry about it. No, 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 nobody. Do you see any of that? No, guess not. That's just a normal thing. I mean, uh, sentient toys exist in this universe, it seems. Ghosts? Yeah, you know, it's like whatever. It's a typical day. <laughs> There's no kids here. What happened to this town? This town seems so lifeless. This doesn't feel right. Mm. 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 Hey, what happened here? We didn't listen. We didn't listen. Ooh. And then vanish. Okay. No letters. No magic. Magic? Okay. I can't read the town name. I've never even heard of anybody talking about another town besides Eve, Lurtabo, Candelio, or Frost. I'm telling you, this is spooking me out. My beefy, muscly arms can't beat up ghosts, you know. We should get out of here. Ghost types are immune to fighting types, you see. Is that a child? A child. Ah, stay back. Yeah, stay back, or I'll throw you some snow. What happened here? The children. They're all bad. They're all taken away. Taken away? There were no more children to write letters. The king. He was angry. The king did this? How? No. The king. Wait. This happened because all the kids were taken away. Then... That will happen well, to Lurtabo. Noel? Come on, Dolcio. Ills, we have to talk to the king. Yeah. Y'all. He says that a lot, by the way. Y'all. I'm not sure. Is there a certain some kind of accent maybe that Ills has or something? Illies? Ellie? Ills? It says yeah a lot. For like you and for yeah. You know, I'm not sure. Anyway. Let's go. I mean, if it is an accent, I don't know how to read it because I, I'm, I don't do accents very well. Or at all, really. Uh, Candelia, the city of lights in the last town before reaching Frost. We have to hurry before the day is over, else you won't uh, get to hand in your letters. Right. Hey, friends. I don't think I can go in. Look, I'm melting. Ills. Don't look at me like that. I'll just wait for you outside town. Go on. You can't stop now. Yeah. Hmm. What is uh, is ill? Because it looks like a little sheep. <laughs> but is it is he actually made out of snow? Or I say he, by the way, because I'm getting a very deep voice. I actually don't know <laughs> what the voice is supposed to sound like. I just assume. Uh, us snow sprites can't handle the warmth too well. Okay, it's a snow sprite. Again, ghosts... Automatons, snow sprites, just an everyday normal occurrence. Which is why we sleep deep underground in the summer. And that means you sleep for a long time. Grandma only sleeps about half a day. 
and I don't sleep. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, I remember actually. Didn't Grandma say to tell Docho to go to sleep? But I assume that he doesn't, right? Because he's just not human. But Docho, you don't sleep? Wait, that's right, you can't. Well, it sucks to be you. Sleeping is so nice. I get to be nice and comfy in my bed and dream. That sounds nice. I don't have dreams. Every moment of my life is a waking nightmare. No, uh, this is a nice conversation and all, but may I remind you that we have to hurry up? Yeah, hurry, don't you? I'll go around the town and meet you on the other side. Okay. All right. Do, 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 do. The mail carrier has probably passed through this town already as well. So let's just get through this town and head to Frost. We can go talk to the king directly. I got a couple of things I want to tell him.